Understanding Built-in Inflation, a guide for English learners. Hello and welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're diving into an economic term that sounds complex but is very much part of everyday discussions about the economy. Built-in inflation. We'll break it down in simple terms, so by the end of this video, you'll not only understand what it means but also be able to discuss it confidently in English. Before we tackle built-in inflation, it's important to understand the basics of inflation itself. Inflation is the rate at which the general level of prices for goods and services is rising, and subsequently, purchasing power is falling. Imagine this year, a chocolate bar costs $1, but next year, due to inflation, the price rises to $1.10. The chocolate bar hasn't changed. Instead, the value of money has decreased, meaning you need more money to buy the same things. Built-in inflation refers to the idea that inflationary pressures persist in the economy due to past inflation. This occurs when workers demand higher wages to keep up with increased living costs, and businesses then pass these increased labor costs onto consumers in the form of higher prices. It's a kind of wage price spiral where wages and prices continuously push each other higher. Think of it as a feedback loop that keeps inflation going, even without new external pressures. To better understand built-in inflation, Let's consider a simple example. Imagine a year where the cost of living increases by 5% due to inflation. Workers, seeing their expenses go up, ask for a 5% raise in their salaries to maintain their standard of living. Employers, facing higher wage costs, decide to increase the prices of their products to maintain their profit margins. This action then contributes to further inflation in the economy creating a cycle that can be difficult to break. The persistence of built-in inflation can have significant effects on an economy. It can lead to a continuous increase in prices, making it harder for people to afford goods and services. This is particularly challenging for those on fixed incomes or whose wages do not keep up with inflation rates. Additionally, it can influence monetary policy decisions, as central banks may raise interest rates to try to control inflation, affecting loans and mortgages. Understanding built-in inflation is crucial for grasping how economies function and why prices change over time. It's a concept that shows the interconnectedness of wages, prices, and purchasing power. We hope this video has shed light on this economic phenomenon and made it easier for you to discuss inflation and its impacts in English. Remember, every big concept can be broken down into simpler parts, making learning both effective and fun. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next video. This structured approach simplifies a complex economic concept, making it accessible for English language learners while also enhancing their vocabulary and comprehension of economic discussions.